continued from instruction to material dynamics. Here introduces an argument about the concept of stress. This is an image of the general concept of deformation. Now, a plate is fixed at its bottom and exposed to a force. The plate should be deformed as shown in the illustration. Just imagine how a small square fraction in this plate is deformed under this force. When the magnitude of the force changes, the certain position in a material moves. Then it deforms the square into a parallelogram, as if the material is inclined or tilted. Under such situation, stress is the concept of force applied to a surface of the small fraction. You may here be noted that stress is a force per unit area. The illustration that have visually shown the deformation defines how the stress deforms an object when acting on a certain surface. Then, how can we use mathematics to describe these deformations? The methodology of material dynamics starts with introducing about how the relationship between external force and deformation, which is equivalent to stress and strain, 